Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, SSL4 Joker here, the crown got himself. And today, once again, yet again, I am pissed at Dragon Ball Z Xenoverse 2. We already got people like, nigga, you still playing this shit? Of course I'm still playing it. Now, for all of you who have watched Phantom's latest video, he explained why he is back in the game basically the same thing with me but I'm not in it for the money well I am but I'm not I actually still like the game you know I like Dragon Ball Z I actually I started my channel off the first universe I like Dragon Ball Z you know and people say this game it isn't competitive there's no, it takes no skill to play this game that is true and it's also not true and let me explain when you playing the scrub ass niggas yeah, it doesn't take any skill to win, but when you're actually playing somebody who know what they're doing, who knows how to work around the little tricks, the little cheese that goes on, you can actually have a motherfucking competitive game, you know what I'm saying? And people, some of the best players say this game is not competitive, it doesn't take any skill, but I believe that a game that allows you to go into flow state and play your heart out is a game that takes competitive skill. It's competitive, you know, amongst the competitive scene amongst the good players now let me explain why I'm pissed and some of the things that I actually do want to talk about in this video but first let me explain this I am pissed because the I don't know if the servers are getting bad well it, I mean we all know the servers are getting worse it actually happened in the first fucking Xeno right in the first fucking Xeno around when the game was dying or has died Xeno has died People don't really play it that much, but some people still do. Um, but around the time where everything was ending, the servers get back, you know, they started getting worse. That's kind of what's happening right now. I was actually trying to practice my combo on this guy. I spent like maybe 30 minutes trying to come up with a cool combo, but I didn't practice it enough. So I ended up going up against this guy, which, you know, the matches were okay at first. You know, it wasn't too much lag, but it seemed like over time. Like, I, I, I legit thought this nigga was Spotify me, and he probably was. Like, he dead ass probably was, but I feel like un it's unacceptable, you know what I'm saying? It's just the invincibility frames and the lag combined really ruins the experience of the game. And, I mean, it's already ruined, but, I mean, come on, man. <sighs> I'm just so fucking sick of this game, and I've been saying this for a long time you see that 12 minute up there you see that you see what it's doing is counting down 12 minutes I am in a player match I have more competitive games more heart beating games more if you make a false move you're done games or comebacks in ranked and I've had moments that in ranked where I could be down in my life like my life could be like this and their life could be in yellow and I am I start to come back and I start whooping their ass and I cannot clutch it because for some fucking reason rank is only three minutes I know some of you has had that moment where you tune in at the last possible second and you become unstoppable and you come back in for the win and right when you finna get, right when you finna win, right when, right when you, when you get this nigga stamina down, and his health is in range where you can blast this nigga and win the game. And right when you get his stamina down, and you finna guard break that nigga, and you guard break him, time's up, and you lose anyway. You know why? Because for some fucking reason, they thought it would be a great idea to keep the rank, uh, ranked out of all. I mean, we already knew about player match, right? You would think that they would take one of their most important game modes, if not the most important game mode to some people, and put more time on it. Or at least give us the option to. You gave us more time to put into motherfucking me endless battles. You even tell, you even put the options to put in capsules in endless battle. But yet you don't put in the options to at least increase the time and rank? You don't put, I've been, I've, I'm pissed off. I, it, it just eats me alive every time that happens because I've had moments because I'm not in my prime in this game anymore I'm not just going to dominate you know I, I can dominate but I'm not just going to life lead you anymore 
I'm one. I'm. I'm not in my prime anymore. If I come back, it probably my health is gonna be low. If you fight me right now, my health is going to be low. And shit like this. 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 This, this is what I don't understand. My health. This is what, what I'm talking about. This is where it start getting bad, and I start getting my ass kicked because I'm confused, and I start getting hit with shit that was from motherfucking me. The app. The, the the mountains, nigga. When I'm in New York. But anyway, back to what I was saying. Why not put in more time? And wait, like, I want you guys in the comment section right now, and I know you have had this moment. I know you have had this moment. The good players, y'all don't have to lie on my channel, bro. Most of the good players I actually know, I know them as opponents, they're my friends. You know, it's like I say, the game, competitive but the environment's not competitive anymore or it could be the other way around when I look at somebody I don't see him as a friend and rank match if I see uh, Colt Damon if I see uh, Kashami if I see uh, Bowman if I see um, fucking D Mercs that's my nigga if I see um, GBG uh, GBG but if I see fucking Chameleon, Kid Chameleon. If I see goddamn me, Tokis, the guy that I fight a lot. If I, I, I apologize if I got your name wrong, bro. Cause you know, uh, I'm, I'm stressed out. But if I see any of good players, I don't treat them as enemies. I treat them as friends. This game is no longer, it's, it's the environment's not competitive anymore. When I see nobody, when I see those people. My heart used to start racing, like, oh shit, I'm gonna get a good battle, I'm getting excited, let's get it. When I see them, my heart would probably jump one second, and then I'd be like, well, <sighs> it's time to see where I stand. It's, it, you know, it's it's shit like that, 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 that just, it, it throws me away from the game, because I don't see anybody as an enemy no more. I don't have, I don't have to prove that I'm one of the best anymore. Most people know it, most people know, they respect your skill. There's a lot of people that's among the best. I'd probably say that I'm one of the best in Dallas. And yes, I'm in Dallas. I don't give a fuck. You know where I'm at. Anybody who is actually in Dallas, let me know in the comment section. I want to play you. I'm going to play off of Best in Dallas. I Yes, I'm being that cocky, nigga. Best in Dallas right now. Hit me up. I am on PS4 if you are interested. So, niggas, that's on motherfucking me Xbox or PC and motherfucking me anywhere I, I'm on PS4. So, if you want to challenge me, you got to be on PS4. I'm calling best in Dallas. But anyway, I feel like that's the shit that pisses me off the most in this game. And it pisses quite quite a lot of you guys off. Because I know y'all had the moments where you're doing like this. Mo you're having the most clutches run. And time runs out. And then you have shit like this that you can't really you don't know if your attacks are gonna hit someone so you like just poking at them and shit you can't tell if you're gonna hit them or not so you end up wasting more stamina than you should and you get your ass kicked or anything like that because the a the servers aren't fixed b you gotta hurry up because time's wrong c it's just a lot of shit look look what is that what is what uh, uh, ah. Ah. This shit like that. Just looking at that pissed me off. Like dead ass. And then you got what the? And then you got this shit. Like, and then how did I miss? I understand he sidestepped, but come, like, whatever. Anyway, on to another thing I want to talk about. It is. I think November 26th right now, November 27th, I don't know the date right now, but it's around time where the fucking DLC is about to come out, usually the DLC comes out on Tuesday, so I'm expecting it to come out on Tuesday, uh, some people think it's going to come out tomorrow, uh, I mean, I would be, I'm wicked, I, I stay up just to check, um, but I think it's going to come out Tuesday, um, just letting you guys know that I'm, I'm mainly getting the DLC for the characters. If you guys want to see some Hero Coliseum or some shit like that, let me know because I'm mainly not gonna be playing Hero Coliseum. I say that until I fucking play Hero Coliseum and I get hooked and start playing Hero Coliseum on my channel. In which case, don't quote me on that, but I'm going to play the characters and I don't know which character I'm gonna make a video for. Um, I can make some combos with these new characters or I can try to because most, most, when new characters come out, you guys fucking look towards Shadow. 
Um, and yeah, I, I, for all of the people who are new who are looking for combos, I would look towards Shadow. Like, his style isn't like my style. You know, he has his own style combos, but if you guys want to figure out some combos, um, look towards Shadow Pierre's channel. I think it's Dissident stuff. Um, you know, shout out to him. I don't really play with him much, but I do respect his grind. As most people do in the community, we expect each other's grind. I wouldn't even wish failed on my worst enemy, you know what I'm saying? So, look at this, this channel if you want to look for combos. But when these characters come out, I am going to be making fucking ranked videos. And that's probably the most I'm going to be on Xeno in a few days. I might even stream characters. I was actually going to... Matter of fact... Happy Thanksgiving. You know what? I'm going to I'm going to have it at the beginning. I'm going to say Happy Thanksgiving because I haven't had the chance to say Happy Thanksgiving because I've been busy this week. But I I I do apologize. So everyone, if I didn't say Happy Thanksgiving to you, Happy Thanksgiving to you guys. I really hope you guys had a good time with your families as I did. I had a great time, but it was still kind of, you know, it wasn't nothing special. The food was great. Just being around my family enough is a blessing, you know what I'm saying? So Happy Thanksgiving. I hope you guys had a real good time with your families. Um, like I said, I might stream when the characters come out, or I might just make like individual character videos of me playing rank or player match with them and showing off some combos. Um, so look out for that in the future. And um, I really, really, I do appreciate the people who has been watching my videos. I say this in most of all of my videos that I talk to you guys in. I appreciate you. I appreciate everything you guys have done for me, giving me tips, uh, challenges. Uh, shout out to all my friends, all of the people who do watch my channel. I do thank you guys. But anyway, that's about gonna be. Ah, uh, let me see. Is there anything else I wanted to talk about in this video? Let me see. You guys watch me destroy this guy, and I will think about it. Give me like 20 seconds because I think I. I don't want to rant too much about the game because I, it's just going to ruin my experience if I start ranting about the game. So, I mean, it's already ruined, but you know, it's going to ruin my good time if I start ranting about the game. Um, so, yeah, look out for the characters. I might stream when the characters come out. I might. So stay tuned on this channel because I'm going to be streaming it over YouTube because I fucking forgot how to stream it on Twitch. But anyway. Um, I, well, I haven't forgot, but I feel like it'll be better noticed on YouTube. But yeah, I think that's about it. I appreciate everybody who's watching. If you're new here, share, like, and subscribe. Um, remember, let me down in the comment section. Let me know if shit like this has happened to you. If you agree with me, if you disagree with me. I don't know why you would disagree with me. But everyone has their opinions. You know what I'm saying? And I am here to respect that opinion. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. And um, I'll hit you up later, I guess. I'm going to let you guys finish watching this fight.